everybody. So today we're going to talk a little bit about dice rolling. So I don't know if you have this game. This is one of the favorites in the Cox household and it's Yahtzee. So Yahtzee is all about rolling dice and your probability of getting different outcomes. So if you've never played this game, this is a great one to play on your own at home. Um, you can download Yahtzee score guides um, online and you can also use Google and roll five dice at a time on Google if you don't have dice at home. So I do have dice, and I know that the probability of getting, let's say, a three is one out of six for a single die. But if I had two dice, then I have all the different outcomes for this one and all the different outcomes for this one. So I have six times six, which is 36 different possibilities. So if you look at a probability table, you can answer lots of questions about dice. So I could say, you know, rolling a pair of dice, six-sided dice, right? Uh, what's the probability of getting an eight or more? What's the probability of getting an even um, result, an even sum? What's the probability of getting a two? Well, the only way you can get a two is if you get what we call snake eyes, which is a one and a one on both of these. So that's only one outcome out of the 36. So you can answer lots of probability questions using um, that table. So the Cox family got some new dice in the mail, and these are called piglet dice. So this is another fun game. Um, you can, it's called Piglet Dice, or there's one that's called Pass the Pigs. And it's all about rolling these little piggies. And the different ways that they land give you different points. So if you look at the score guide, if it lands on its back, you get three points. So this one would be three points here. But if it lands on its side, it's only one point. And if it lands on its feet, it is five points. Now the hardest one is when it lands on its snout. And if the piglet lands on its snout, then you get a whopping 10 points. So you can come up with your totals. So my question is, based on this little guide, um, there are four different ways that the piggy can land. It can land on its side, it can land on its back, it can land on its snout, or it can land, now I'm, and now I'm thinking, oh, on its feet. So is this like having a four-sided dice? I don't know. So. My question to you is every time I roll, am I equally likely to get a piglet on its back, on its side, on its snout, or on its feet? I don't know. You can roll and you can try it each time. So this time I had four that landed on its side and one that landed on its feet. And I can do those different outcomes. So is it like a four-sided die? That's my question to you. I'm going to ask you some different possibilities for two dice and I'll ask you about these little piglets. Um, good luck.